Joining me today at the NYSE's ETF Summit is Darren Sharinga. He is the founder and CEO of Asymmetric ETFs. Darren, wonderful to have you here today. Thanks for joining me. Judy, it's a pleasure. Thanks for having me. Thanks. Okay, so tell me now, Darren, what are your expectations for the markets as 2022 comes to a close? Well, the Fed's going to keep fighting inflation. They're getting an A on high employment, correct, and an F in price stability. So they have to bring inflation down. So the Fed will continue to increase interest rates. Over the weekend, they've telegraphed at a slower rate. So I think interest rates are going up. The market's going to fight. I think it's going to be hard. Don't fight the Fed. Right? Don't fight the Fed on the way down because the market goes up when they're tightening. Don't fight the Fed because it's probably going to bring the market down. So I think we're going to have a choppy market coming into the end of the year. Okay. Now tell me, how should advisors be preparing their portfolios for 2023? Okay. I think you should be prepared for volatility. I, if you look at volatility, it's been around since 2018. So it's been a lot of years of, of increased market volatility. So I think 2022, our current year, taught advisors a lot of things. The black swan events still exist. Equities went down, bonds went down together. They shouldn't have them. The 60-40 portfolio broke down. So advisors need to look for new tools to how to manage risk. And you need something that is uncorrelated to stocks or bonds that provides diversification benefits. So I think, look around our ETF, the asymmetric S&P 500, ASPY, provides that type of diversification benefits. So take a look at it, I'd advise your advisors. <laughs> All right, Darren, always great to talk with you. Thanks for joining me. Thanks, Judy.